Hey Bulldogs, Chris Bryant here. I got a CCNP route and T-shoot quick quiz for you here on some route redistribution. So let's jump right in and then we'll check out the answers on live Cisco routers. You've redistributed the route 3333-32 into OSPF with no seed metric specified via the redistribute connected command. Which of the following best describes the net result? A. The route will appear in OSPF with a seed metric of 20. B. The route will not appear in OSPF. C. The route will not appear in OSPF and the command is rejected by the iOS. Or D. The route will appear in OSPF with a seed metric of zero. If you want to pause the video for a moment and think about your answer, that's a great idea. Right now, let me thank you for making me the number one instructor at Udemy.com. And it's all thanks to your support. Check out Udemy.com slash U slash Chris Bryant. I'm going to bring that up on the screen really quick. And that will show you all the courses I'm teaching out there right now, including my free and almost free courses. And always make sure to check for a discount code right here in the description above Take This Course. As you can see, you can get my full NP Video Bootcamp right now for $99. That's about $2 an hour for my world-class training. Pretty good deal. Free courses for the CCNA and CCNA Security as well. So make sure to check that out when you have a moment. And let's get back to this question. So we're doing some route redistribution. And I'm doing it with the redistribute connected command on router 3, which is going to have our loop back. Let's bring the router up. And just to show you, I'm not doing anything tricky here. Um, here's our Ethernet interface. We're doing a little HSRP on there, but that doesn't matter for this one. And we've got an OSPF adjacency, hopefully, with router 2. So we will check that out first, of course, with neighbor. Thank you. And full, so everything's just fine there. So let's go ahead and do that route redistribution. And the question mentioned redistribute connected, and that's it. So let's go over to router two. And with OSPF being pretty quick, I notice we don't see that yet. Well, let's go back to the question because you'll notice the line here, only classful networks will be redistributed. The question talks a lot about a seed metric but the seed metric isn't the issue because with the seed metric, of course, that is a default of what no SPF 20, right? We don't have to specify when we can if we want to, but we don't have to. The problem here is that if you just use the redistribute connected command, and that's exactly what the question said, you're going to get this little message that says only classful networks will be redistributed. Well, that's probably not what we want, especially with OSPF. And in this case, that non-classful network is not going to be successfully redistributed. So we do have a problem. It just didn't have anything to do with the seed metric. So if you looked at that question and said, oh, okay, well, you know, the OSPF seed metric is 20, then you might have said A, uh, but with redistribute connected by itself, it's not going to appear at all. So what do we need there? Redistribute connected subnets, right? Consider subnets for redistribution into OSPF. It's pretty formal sounding, but that's what we want. And now you'll notice we see our route, and of course it's got that E2 default, and you know what that code means. If you don't, uh, check out one of my OSPF videos on YouTube because I've got one on that subject as well. But the correct answer here this time would be B. The route would not appear in OSPF because we didn't have the subnets option on the end of it. Thanks for taking today's route and t-shoot quick quiz. I'm Chris Bryant. Thanks for making us part of your CCNP success story.